Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Uh, grenades take wow. three. Take three. Come on. No. Do no. it before they all move. I'm trying. Okay, that one's gonna get away, but that's a, that's okay. Oh, the napalm takes three. Grenades take two. I know, but napalm. It makes me feel better. <laughs> I want to kill them with fire. <laughs> What the fire's for? The way she's whoa! <laughs> fucking hell. damn! That crab made her angry. No kidding. That one's trying that to get away. Moment, you know her like spin up of the the wrench and the the sparklies that come out of her feet when she charges up. I'm like, I'm, I'm getting this by the power of Grayskull vibe, and then she fucking wrecked that thing in one shot. That was impressive. Yeah, she clearly knows what she's doing. Oh, yeah. Yeah, she needed it to not be. <laughs> this is what an engineering degree gets you. Yeah, clearly. <laughs> Phenomenal Patrick. physical power. We went into the wrong field. <laughs> no kidding. Man, if anyone had told me that that was a benefit of an engineering degree, I wouldn't have changed majors. <laughs> <laughs> like, I, I originally never, went in for computer engineering. class. Oh, well, computer engineering. Well, that's a little different. She's got a wrench. You never need <laughs> wrenches in computer Ren engineering. Yeah, I should have gone for wrench engineering. Exactly. See? Exactly. Re wrench engineering. But mm. Nah, where the fuck are we? Okay. I'm so lost. I'm dazed and confused. Oh, hello. Random it's bounty okay. hunters. <laughs> Maybe oh. these helpful people can uh, stab us in the right direction. Oh, look! Everything's in a clump now. I need two bars for grenades. Yep. Oh, <gasps> that bastard! Just straight up took your money! It, it's amusing Gosh. how... Yeah, well, we'll hopefully get it back at the end, but I, I'm very amused how we've reached a point where everything clumps together now that we don't have Runner in the party. <laughs> yeah, if you put him back in, it'll go back. Right. Kill the one that casts the spells. That was a very sparkly hit with the wrench. It was. That must be the world's most polished wrench. It's well. glittery. <laughs> <laughs> I just so sassy. I love her animation. Stab. Awesome! And then they explode and glitter. Oh, he ran away with our money. Wow! Right. He just noped right out of there. Okay, then. Well, we're, we're still gonna kill his buddies, I mean... Yeah. You're still worth experience points, even though your friend left. Yeah, it, it's a case of he stole 30 gold from us, but we're probably gonna get more than that just from killing his two friends. So... <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Holy oh, no. shit. But that and getting through his stupid barrier spell wouldn't have been worth the effort to get the 30 gold back. <laughs> All right, we're going to attack these guys. Because we have to. Well, because partly that and because every walkthrough that I read said something along the lines of, as long as you kill everything in every area, you don't have to worry about grinding. <laughs> so we won't run Good into idea. that problem we okay. had in the first okay. session. Can I bring up a problem with this plan? What's the that? fact that you read multiple walkthroughs sounds like grinding to me. <laughs> <laughs> it's just grinding outside of the game sphere. Ah, okay. Well, the game sphere I heard was a complete flop. They only launched it in one town in Colorado. All the kids wanted it. Yeah. The worst part was that's not actually a town, it's a county. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Maya leveled up. Is she better now? Maybe. Oh, hold on. The, supposedly, 
Not that it really means anything beyond hit points and attack power, maybe. It's not like you gain anything from increasing levels. Yeah, it'd be kind of neat if their outfits changed. Or they got new abilities or something. You're you're asking too much here from this game. I mean... From this game, yes. From literally any other RPG that was around at the time, that would be standard practice. Uh, you know what, Pat? Jot it down, and we'll put it in for the remaster. That's right. You mean the rewrite. Well, I mean, that's largely what they do with remasters now anyways, so... Uh, let's just give it a soft reboot. <laughs> <laughs> Next time we'll just call it Septera. We'll leave out the core. Ooh, I like because it. the core gameplay will be completely upended. Yes. We'll write it as a... a se uh, it'll be a, a soft reboot, so it'll be a semi-prequel. <laughs> <laughs> Half of the game takes place before all of this, and then skips the unnecessary parts in Septeracore, so there's only half of that game left. So we've got just a complete So it's story. gonna be about 10 <gasps> minutes long. Holy shit! Ow! Oh no! I wasn't paying attention! Happen? Uh, it, it happened when we stopped eating bread. <laughs> you fool! We, for, we forgot to ram bread in her face. Stuff it in now, just in case. <laughs> okay, okay, hold on, we'll give her some bread. Because I don't think the smell saw... Yeah. Quick, eat some bread. <laughs> yeah, that's partial hit points, all right. Oops. Yeah, his regular attack does 11, and he somehow downed her. Like, what the hell? Well, it turns out that she's a fire type, and he's a water type. Oh. <laughs> and he used bubble beam. I thought that just means she wasn't going on another date with him. Well, that too. I mean, would you go out with somebody who just KO'd you? <laughs> Probably not. Well, it depends on the time frame. If it's, like, immediately after they KO'd me, I'm not sure I'd have much of a choice. You. But yeah. I'm, I'm kind of... I feel dirty having said that and come to that realization. <laughs> oh, he's no longer clicked. No! I was gonna kill you before you got another turn. Get him! Eh. <laughs> <laughs> the little jump kick with that, that's just... Well, she's trying to get extra power by adding gravity into the mix. She's also, just so the sparkle horrible. effect when she does her full power wrench smash, I kind of want there to be like a, a, a piano trill. Just <laughs> accompanying the, the burst of sparkles. Oh, this is a treasure chest. <laughs> I found a wallet. The hell? Is there money in it? Um, is it an equipment piece? Yes, it is. It was on that first page. Protects from steel. Because Partially. They, take your, they take your wallet instead. Oh my god. You you can literally equip a fake wallet for mothers. Yeah, yeah. that that's a thing. Wow. Oh, there's a throne. A throne. Is there? Right. Oh. right be, yeah. Yeah. Right there, is a, there is a chair. I am emperor of this room. <laughs> <laughs> of this room. These barrels are mine. That office chair is mine. The valve is definitely mine. Kicks up his feet. Behold my Ottoman Empire. Oh, uh, that was bad, Patrick, and you should feel bad. <laughs> I've got a chain link fence through which I can threaten other empires. <laughs> like the king of no pants. <laughs> If I remember correctly, the barrier spell kind of protects against X number of attacks, so I'm better off just, you know, hitting him as much as often as possible. We said hitting him, Maya. Did he? He's stealing my core energy. Dick. 
that's not a mechanic that should be in this game. Like, it's so evil. Are we going to get that back? <laughs> I don't know. Probably let's not. Let's kill him and find out. I bet he runs away. He's like, haha, suckers. This car energy is mine. And, and what do you want to bet we never get an ability that allows us to do it? Oh, of course not. That would be unbalanced. Well, either that or we get it at such a ridiculous... Oh, hi, there's Aram. We did such a ridiculously high level that it's not useful anymore. Oh my god, come on. Maya, Maya, ah. <laughs> Door. Door. It's locked. Oh my god. We gotta go get a key. Oh my god. <laughs> uh. Oh, hi. <laughs> is, is there no such thing as a rogue in this game? I think Aram Elm is the rogue. Rock. For crying out loud. Well, then he should be able to save himself. Yeah. What's How come shit? he didn't find us and say, can I be a protagonist now? It, it's because he has uh, robot arms, so when they caught him, they took them off. So he can't <laughs> pick locks anymore. Well, that's it, a damn clever of them. It was the only yeah, sensible that's... thing to do. I, I would congratulate them, but I feel that would give them almost too much credit. Please die. Thank you. I am dramatically overkilling some of these guys with uh, with Salida and Lead, and I feel so bad for Maya over here because she hasn't had a weapon upgrade in a while. Yeah, because nobody apparently makes rifles anymore. But they make handheld runner beam cannons for this uh, Joker in the in the bottom here. Yeah, at least he's in the bottom and not where uh, that guy is, because he'd probably be just due to the way the lines work. He'd probably be able to hit two of my characters at once. Yeah, and of course he's he's all barriered up. Oh, of course, I was hoping he has a to... grenade launcher because reasons. <laughs> I was hoping to get a turn before the uh, the dude that cast the barrier spells just to prevent it, but nope. <sighs> also, this scan is really not worth it if uh, their hit points are off the screen. Y yeah, really. Then again, even if they weren't, uh, it still wouldn't be worth it because it's only one enemy at a time and it's not information that carries over. Well, that's why we have the cheat code in. Yeah. Poor Corgan, his ability is worthless. Yeah. To the oh. point where they turned it into a cheat code. And he was nigh immediately replaced by a different, better sword wielding character. <laughs> yeah. Like Grub, who was immediately replaced by a different, better mechanic character. It's no, okay. As literally anybody else. <laughs> it's okay, we'll use them both for side quests later. Uh, oh, I'm sure we will. Oh, we're gonna 100% this? No, there's just certain side quests that are worth doing because they get these three characters better items. <laughs> I see. Yeah, we're, we're, we're gonna use Grub, and we'll use... Oh, now, now you gotta die. Um, oh, you son of a bitch. But it's okay, we made out with literally three times as much as he stole. No, he stole uh, 200 this time. Oh, really? Yeah. So he netted a, a, a loss of two from us. Is it the same guy? Is this just how he makes his living? Uh, <laughs> oh, look. I explain to me why the switch up here opens that door. Like... And this is a sewer, not a prison. Right. Like, what normally, what purpose would it serve? Oh, you know what? It's, uh, the, the boss sits on the throne of his empire and walkie talkies up to a guard up here whenever he wants to let Aram in or out. <laughs> that was our problem. We didn't sit here and uh, use the walkie talkie. Like I'll never die. I lose my head in the starry skies. 